have a morning, and I brush my teeth and comb my hair. When I wake up every morning, I brush my teeth and comb my hair. Saying what a fine day, I have a Cadillac sitting over there. <laughs> when I get my money, I put it right in the bag. When I get my paycheck, I put it right in the bag. This is Chris Holt reporting for Voxypop, here today in the Cancer Center with Althea. Thank you so much for having us. It's a pleasure. I gotta get a Cadillac. It just makes me smile, and I sure it's, it makes them smile too. Yeah, you did some dancing. I saw you dancing. Yes, yes, I love music. And who doesn't like music? We normally have overhead music for the patients, but having a live person singing, <laughs> that's so much better. Well, I'm sitting in the bar, knocking them back. Yes, it's, it's, I mean, like, nobody knows what a person with cancer thinks or feels. I mean, to sit in a room like this, sometimes you need a little enjoyment for something so bad. You know, anything to boost your spirits up, that's what it takes. So, it works. I enjoyed it. That's great. Thank you. <laughs> Get her spirits, thank you. What brings you here, you know, this is one of these things, this is different from every other gig, so what, what, what brings you here today? Um, when you asked me if I wanted to come and do this, I was excited at the opportunity to kind of be in a different environment, um, and I was also a little nervous because, you know, you said we were playing at a hospital, I was scared I was going to be sad, but seeing everybody doing their... Um, or chemo at the same time and like, smiling and tapping your foot is just a, a different type of appreciation, I think, for what music does for people. So the feel of this, how does this differ from other gigs? It's obviously way different. Obviously way different. Um, I'd say sometimes, so every gig that I've always done is usually a restaurant or a bar. To be honest, I'm in the background. I mean, every once in a while it's an original show and that's your, you know, time to shine. But here it was more like, I feel like being like a servant just in life, like a calling. Um, music kind of helps connect people, kind of helps you relax. Just seeing their faces, like knowing that they're going through something that was not the best and being able to provide like emotional happiness through music was kind of what I think is very different than just playing at a bar. That's awesome, thank you. Can you explain a little bit about the Tree of Life for me? Okay, so one of the staff came up with an idea that we should have something to celebrate the patients when they finish their treatment. So we came up with a Tree of Life with the butterflies and stuff. After they finish their treatment, they will put a little quotation or something on the butterfly and they'll put it up there, they'll ring the bell um, three times well. So they're at the end of their treatment, so they put their butterflies, so the butterfly is flying away, telling them that we have um, accomplished this hurdle in our life, and we're moving on. Would you say Healing in Harmony de-stresses overall? Yes, yes, you guys have great voices. I really think it's a great thing to have, and I wish that you go and continue this. We will. For us. We will. This is sort of like a shout out and a calling to all musicians to come down here and volunteer your time by playing music. It's a real easy thing, and it makes a huge difference in people's lives. Once again, Chris Holt reporting for Voxypop here at Phoenixville Hospital, Tower Health.